Hey, Radians here. Let's deploy a Next.js static app to AWS S3 and CloudFront. You can find all the source code in the description. Here is the deploy script. It requires two variables, bucket S3 bucket name and distribution ID, CloudFront distribution ID. Since it's a static app, Next.js will generate everything into the out folder. We want to cache all the files in the out directory except for HTML files and the service worker. To achieve that, we first perform a sync with the delete flag and exclude sv.js and all HTML files. Then we do a copy with the exclude everything flag and then we include HTML and service worker file. Afterwards, we need to create a copy of every HTML file without the HTML extension. This is necessary because if a user visits a page like about, a stream will not return the about.html file. Instead, it will return either the about file without an extension or the index.html file inside the about folder. To create an S3 bucket and set up CloudFront, we can use Terraform. You can view the entire step in the repository below. I already have a hosted zone and a certificate for HTTPS, so I provide them through variables instead of creating new resources. I also pass reactkit.region.com as the domain and the host zone for the root region.com domain in the remaining variables. Next, we proceed to the main.tf file and create the S3 bucket, CloudFront distribution, and Route 53 record. To become an effective programmer, check out my productivity app at increaser.org.